Hi everyone, this is The Bent Knitter. Welcome back. So this week I wanted to go into a project that I've been working on, which has been really kind of fun. Um, a couple weeks ago, someone mentioned in my live streams about the traveling Afghan. If you haven't already, join me for streams every Thursday night at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But this really kind of piqued my interest. Uh, what it is, is every two weeks, starting in January, so it's already started, um, a new designer puts out a 10 by 10 square for a blanket, which is really cool, which is really interesting. Each designer is from a different part of the world, so that's where we kind of get the traveling Afghan from, or the traveling part of it from. Um, and then we'll have an Afghan. Ta -da. But so it's been really kind of fun and interesting to part. Uh, so far right now there's been about six squares that has been released um, I'm really kind of enjoying it just because each square is different and unique and uh, Some of them are a little bit more challenging than others, which I enjoy quite a bit um, But some of them are kind of rather simple where it's just kind of like a dot pattern which comes out really nicely um, And some of it's just like a basket weave a variation, which is really cool um, now I've just I have a box of random yarn that I'm using, but they do have all the details um, on the website. The website that I've been using is going is 5410 Studios. Um, I will put a link down in the description below uh, because they have all the information and they keep a current list of all the patterns that have been released. Um, but some of them are a little bit more complicated um, or a little bit more challenging like this one. This I had to start over once or twice. Uh, but it came out really well and I'm happy with it. Um, the reason why I kind of like uh, doing the, or why I am so excited about this is the fact um, for each square is the, pension, uh, is the potential to learn new stitches and new kind of technique. So it's a good challenge for yourselves, even if you've been knitting for a long time, it's something different every week. Um, and I've also already learned one or two things like this past week uh, was a flower stitch so I learned this um, kind of flower stitch which is pretty cool and but also um, they're pretty small projects so that way um, you're not committing to a lot of time and effort into something that you may or may not like um, it's a short square it's a tiny square so that way you can kind of get the hang of it see if you like it and if you like it you can go into more later with bigger projects gives you a taste of um, a lot of different things um, that's why I'm kind of enjoying it so much um, so the other two that we've been knitting uh, this one has a crown um, as a crown on the back which is cool um, and it's fun to do um, but also, uh, it was actually interesting for like this one, um, most of the uh, squares so far have been from like the top or bottom to top. This one you actually started in the corner and you went um, from corner to corner. So um, it was a lot of fun um, and something different to do. So again, uh, every week is a little bit something different, something unique, something that may challenge you a little bit. I think that, again, that's why I'm enjoying it so much. But I will leave all the details in the description below. If you decide to join me on this traveling Afghan journey, please let me know. I'll be excited to see uh, what you do with it. And I will see you next week. Bye.